All right, another episode here of Nick on Campus. Uh, now it's kind of the NU Cribs version here, yep. Nick. So tell us where we are. and uh, We are here in our apartment, me, Davide, Coletti, and John Cerna. Uh, share a three-bedroom apartment, and uh, just going to give you a little tour. Now you asked me to take my shoes off, so yeah. you don't want me to leak all over these really plush hardwood floors, right? <laughs> yes, we... Uh, we did some hard Swiffer work uh, earlier <laughs> <laughs> earlier uh, this month to uh, clean the floors. So. Okay, the maid is is on vacation or something, yeah. right? Yeah, <laughs> on vacation. <laughs> but anyways, so right, let's go, man. Get in here. Here's my shoe rack. As you can see, I got a bunch of shoes. Got my dress shoes, my terrain shoes, basketball shoes. Terrain shoes. <sighs> what would what would terrain shoes? Well, be basically. For? For snowy days when it gets okay. really muddy, got it. dirty okay. out on the streets. And Division one athletes got to have lots of kicks, man. Yeah, so lots here, of kicks. I'll take you into the kitchen. Uh, a little dirty right now, but this is how it looks, uh, you know, on a daily basis. And usually we just enter through the back entrance right here. Got it. Okay. So we've right, got all our shoes okay. here. So more shoes here, guys. So here you see it. We're seeing here first, man. There, are, there's shoes all over the apartment. Yep. But of course, shoes are an important part of your life. True that. So, <laughs> as you can see, we got last night after the game, we got okay. uh, fried chicken for a post game meal. Usually we get big pizzas. but uh, okay. And this was training table food, right? No, no. After games, we, we get uh, Lumanati's, either pizza oh, or got it. Right, like right. chicken parm sandwich or fried chicken. So, yeah. Now, whose who's turn is it to do the dishes? I mean, right now, dishes, I mean, they're at a suitable level, you know, but. Uh, <laughs> As soon as it starts to pile up a little more, we'll be flipping the cards and playing FIFA to see who who has to do the dishes. That's right. So you flip, you you actually have a card flipping yeah, yeah. Uh, method. I'll, I'll show you. Let's go into the living room now. Yeah, this is for anybody out there who has roommates and you're kind of wondering, okay, how do I determine who does the dishes? Well, you know, these these Northwestern basketball players have got a system that, that you think really should be used universally, worldwide, right? Yeah, all right. So uh, what we do, first let's say hi to Dav. What's up? Dav, how's it going, man? Sizzle, Dav, Nathan, in the building. All right, so what we do is we got the cards. Okay. So I'll say, Dav, cut the cards. There you go. John's not here right now. But then we'll flip them three times. And each of us will pick a number. Got Whoever it. has the highest card doesn't have to play. So they're like, they got the buy, and they don't have to play to, for the dishes. So then, you know, we got the TV over here, the Xbox. Uh, and I'm not sure what's, I mean, what's more important to you guys, like an actual basketball or an Xbox? <laughs> I mean, if you, had to, if you lost one, what would, like, be more devastating for you guys? Uh... Well, for Dob, the Xbox. <laughs> and, uh, and basketball. Basketball, yeah. For sure. Okay, because, I mean, Xbox, you're, you're not a scholarship Xbox player, right? But no. you probably could be, right? I mean, you guys no, play enough, no, right? No. Okay, all right. I mean, that'd be fun, but uh, I don't know. After about a half hour, an hour, it gets a little... Uh... Things, uh, things get a little heated here at the apartment. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So this is the living room situation. Basically, we got the comfy couch. You know, we got the uh, picture. We got the MJ here, and also we have the uh, good old days right here. Me dunking on Geneva. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here we go. Back in the day. Yep. Here we go, Nick Man, going over the Vikings, right? Yeah, with my two-inch vertical. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Debbie, has, has that vertical increased since you've been at school, or is that decreased? Yeah, probably about like over 0.1 inches. <laughs> and yeah, as you can see, we, we work hard to study the scout, you know. There you go. That's right. That's right. How'd that work out for you guys against Penn State? Uh, it worked out terribly, but we won't talk about that anymore. Yeah. That's right. Burn the tapes, right, guys? Just burn yeah. the tapes. And also, here's one of our prized possessions of the last month. When we went to Michigan, John's aunt made us like 100 cookies and they're all in here and we just snacked on that for like a whole just month. Just feasted, huh? How long did those last? You said a full month? Yeah, yeah, probably. Any any fecal remnants of any cookies laying around in there? <laughs> I don't know. Can we squeeze out maybe like a a, a dried chocolate chip or something? Crumbs, there we go. We got a few still in there, guys. You see that? That's high def, man. That's high def right there. <laughs> Right, here we go. All right, so Nick Fruit, NU Cribs. Thanks, uh, David, with the E on the end of it. So <laughs> pronounce it again for us one more time. It's Davide. Davide. Yeah. Okay, here we go. So this is how this is the lifestyle of a Division One athlete, right here, guys. Yep. Yeah.